I'm blessed to be returning to the ring after a year full of complications. During this time, I had plenty of time to think about what I needed to and wanted to work on in order to get the win in my next fight. My main three things I've been working on was stamina, punch output, and punch accuracy. I need enough oxygen in the tank to be able to do what I'm thinking, be able to go as hard as I can all three rounds without getting tired, and do what I need to do to get the win. And my punch output, because I feel like my last fight, I lost because I was throwing the more accurate punches or the more harder punches. But he was most definitely putting in more work and more punch output than me, which is most important in the amateurs and punch accuracy. So I could place my punches in the right spots to get the outcome that I'm looking for. But thank you guys for watching the video. I hope you all enjoyed the video. I really worked hard on this. So if y'all can, y'all go ahead, like, follow the links below and leave a comment if you can. Thank you for watching. Enjoy. So this is day one. I'm taking my weight. I weighed in at 179, which is really good because I got to fight at 176, which means I don't have to cut a lot of weight. So you can see me being excited in this clip right here. All right, what's up, guys? So I guess I'm just right here. I'm just going to be explaining what I'm going to do for the next three days. Luckily, I'm not too above weight, so cutting weight is going to be really easy this time. I'm supposed to be fighting at 176, and I'm 179 right now. So I only have three pounds to cut in three days, which is gonna be light work. So for today, what I got, I'm gonna go ahead and go to the track. I'm gonna go in a sauna for like 20 minutes and I'm gonna sit in red light and I have work at three. So today gonna be a kind of light day. On Monday, we are gonna be more focused on like getting as much weight off as possible because I don't wanna go in and weigh in at 176. I wanna weigh in at like 175, 174 because it's a three day tournament. I wanna be able to stay below 176 so i'm gonna make sure i'm a little bit below weight i like to be over prepared rather than not prepared and like need to be prepared it's better that have something and not need it than to need something i have my grandma used to always tell me that but anyways so yeah on monday i'm gonna um be trying to cut a little bit more weight and if i at my weight goal at 174 175 on monday then on tuesday i'm most definitely gonna just chill out i'm not gonna put nothing in my body i'm just gonna chill out i'm gonna recover ice bath red light massage chair and just making sure that i'm as ready rejuvenated and ready to go on wednesday Cause, yeah i fight wednesday today is sunday and it's a three-day tournament it's wednesday thursday friday friday is the championship for me each day i win i progress so yeah y'all gonna take y'all along with this journey with me thank y'all for coming on and watching Thank y'all. If you're watching right now, y'all go ahead and subscribe. And it'll be great. Alright, what's up guys? So we finally made it to the track. I'm with my boy D. Allen, man. We finna get this work in. Um, so what we got today is I'm gonna hit the agility ladders for um five minutes just to get a little warm-up in. And then right after that, we're gonna go into eight four hundreds. We're gonna do eight four hundreds and then after that the workout's over and we're gonna go um to the sauna and to the red light. So I'm gonna show y'all a little bit of the workout, then. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, that's pretty much it.
We don't want to do this shit. But I gotta get done. Ain't that right? Putting the work, there's somebody out there that is. They gonna take your spot, young nigga. Oh God, they gonna take that shit. And you gonna forever be a dreamer. Putting that work, fuck. All right, look. So we finally made it to the gym. Let me see. All right, so we finally made it to the gym. Let's see. I got a world gym, you know, pretty good, pretty cool gym. So we finna go doing that. We finna spend 15 minutes in the red light. I don't know if I'm gonna do the massage chair and that depends on how time is. Cause I gotta go to work at three. But we do 15 minutes in the um in the red light and then we're gonna do 20 minutes in the sauna. I might push for more if I can, but 20 minutes is the minimum. And yeah, this is a good way to get the weight off you. The red light, it has many benefits. I really believe everybody should be doing that. I know Floyd Mayweather used to do it all the time. That's why I originally discovered it from so yeah i guess i'm gonna go ahead and see y'all in the sun in the real life So I'm on weight. So I'm pretty good. I'm gonna show y'all. Subtract the um pants and shirt. Pants and shirt. My pants is about a pound. So I'm probably like 0 0.2, 0 0.3 overweight, but I'm basically on weight. So what we're gonna eat today is I'm probably gonna eat some yogurt, some fish, and some chicken. Like no carbohydrates, nothing that's gonna make me retain any water weight. And yeah, so that's basically what my meal is gonna be for the next today. I'm really not gonna record my meals because they don't look pretty. So yeah, I'm on weight, so that's a good thing. And I guess I'll catch y'all tomorrow. <laughs> Ha, ha, ha. 